Pastor Ephraim and Pastor Carol. This is Unlimited Faith in Favor Ministries, and this is our weekly Thursday night, 6 p.m. Uh, Bible study, um, and uh, 3D Bible study and prayer. And we're going to welcome every morning has started. Welcome everybody right now. And today it's an honor and a privilege to present. We have a guest speaker and most of you know him already, but it's just a privilege to have him in the house and to be able to uh, present him today. He's bringing a, a powerful, powerful word. And you, most of you know him, and it's uh, Apostle Mikhail Snooks. Uh, so today, uh, we're going to have the privilege and the honor uh, and seeing how the Holy Spirit is going to use him to speak to his people, to the church. So God bless you, and with no further ado, uh, Apostle Amen, amen. God bless amen, you, everybody. Amen. God bless everybody. God bless you. 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 We're online with you. Uh, you give us some amens too, all right? Okay, amen. amen. Let's do this before we get started. Praise God. We're going to open up with a word of prayer. Father, in Jesus' name, thank you for this day, this opportunity. Thank you for your people. Thank you, God, for this house, this chapel, yes. the soterrace. We thank you, dear God, for what you've done to birth the church and to upgrade and upkeep and maintain. We just bless you, Lord, for what you're doing. Holy Spirit of God, we ask you tonight to speak to the hearts of your people, heal somebody, help somebody, deliver somebody, and we'll be careful to give you all the honor, the glory, and the praise. In Jesus' name we pray, amen and amen. amen. If you would lift up your voices for just a second, normally on, the, on, t on tape I wouldn't do this, but I love to praise God anyway. If you just sing with me, let's stand on your feet if you want. I sing praises to your name. Oh, praises to your name. Before time began and it was he ordained that you would be adopted once you got here through Jesus Christ it was all about him God birthed you adopted you in Christ Jesus and now the Holy Spirit mentors us continuously can somebody just give him again thank Thank you, Jesus. 
speak for just a few minutes today on a uh, subject matter that uh, I believe the Lord uh, gave me this morning in my own prayer time, and it's uh, called Receiving Multiplied Grace and Peace. Receiving Multiplied Grace and Peace. How many of you know what multiplied is? Amen. 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 Many times. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Thank you, sis. Receiving multiplied grace and peace. And we're going to be taking our, uh, our, 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 our study today from Second Peter, the first chapter. Second Peter, the first chapter. If you have your Bibles, you can turn there with me. And I'm going to read the first seven verses. And after reading the first seven verses, we're going to go back and just kind of talk about just what's being said in these verses. Uh, we had some great discussions earlier, and um, one of the one of the things that has came out of these discussions is that, uh, especially as we earlier we were earlier talking about it, was that we needed to uh, check our own selves out. We needed to make sure that we were in love with the Lord God, and not just in love with church, not just in love with religion, not just in love with doing things, doing things called called church things. Amen. We need to make sure it's God that we're, we've been after. Amen. You know, I'm not, I'm, I believe that, praise God, God was reaching out to humanity, not just uh, a, a church. Yes, sir. There's no such thing as church in the first chapter of the book of the Bible, Genesis. Mm -hmm. I don't think anybody heard me on that. Yeah. There's Amen. no such thing Amen. as church in the first chapter of Genesis. Yeah. There's no such thing as born again in the first chapter of the book of Genesis. All right now. There's no such thing no as such thing. Uh, baptism. All right. You know why? Because God was after God created humanity. Yes. Yes. It was humanity that got into a situation, and it's humanity that God's getting out of the situation. Yes, Come on, somebody. He's Amen. not just building church. He's building people. Come on. Amen. 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 Come on. Amen. He's not just building Amen. church. He's building people. Amen. Amen. Praise God. And, and, and I believe that that's what God wants to do with us. He wants to build each one of us. Each one of us, and as he builds each one of us, as we mature yes, sir. and continue in, the, as we continue to mature in the things of God, not mature in the things of religion, because yes, religion will have us going on Sunday morning, uh, maybe Sunday evening, and then back maybe on Wednesday, and then next week do the same thing over again. And then, and then we'll maybe do. We may do conferences, a conference in the summer, and then and and the next uh, yeah. uh, and keep doing that yeah. over and over again. Yeah. It's like going around and around and around in a wilderness without ever going into that promised place that God has for you. How many believe that there's an end game that God has? Amen. Amen. How many believe that there is a place called maturity? Yes. yes. He let he let his he, he let his children uh, Joshua. Uh, uh, the children of Israel, that was a destination that they were they were on their way to. How many believe you're on you're on your way in a to a destination? Yes. Yes. Come on, you got to understand, and that's what God is doing. You you don't you don't get to the place, praise God, where God matures uh, 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 that magnificent gift that He placed down on the inside of you. You don't get to the place where He matures it to you at a certain level now, yes. where you know how to flow with the Holy yes. Spirit. You know how to 
hear what the Holy Spirit is saying. You know how to walk when he said walk, talk when he says talk. He doesn't take you back to the time before you got born again. Amen. He doesn't sit you in situation and have you regurgitate in something for the next 20 years when he's already matured you past that and now expects you to be utilized as the tool that God made you to be, utilized as the piece of, pu of the puzzle that God made you to fulfill in your generation. He doesn't keep going over the same things over and over again. Yes. Come on, are you hungry? Praise God for your next level. Amen. Yes. Come on, are you hungry for your next level? Yes. yes. Because your next level is not going back to the place before you were born again and sitting there talking about, uh, 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 and Moses crossed the Red Sea and how, and you need to cross your Red Sea and and listen, uh, it's okay when we have problems in our lives and and we testify and, and and minister that God brings us out of those things, but God is not just bringing us out of something. He's taking us into something. Come on, yes, yes. Take Come on, somebody. Take somebody lift your heart up for just a minute and say, God, take me into my destiny. God, take me into my destiny. Come on, take me into my destiny. We can't die before we get into our destiny. All right. Come on. Yes. We can't die until we get into our destiny. We can't die. Paul said, uh, I, I, I have finished my course. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Uh, even though he finished, he knew it that wasn't all because he says, I don't count myself to have apprehended. I mean, meaning, I, 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 I don't know it all. But he says, I finished my course. Finish my course. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Praise yeah. God. God's got a place. God's got a, 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 a destiny for you. He's been training you all of your Christian life. And some of us don't know it, but some of your worldly life, he was training you. Mm -hmm. Amen. Come on. Amen. Come on. Amen. Praise God. Yeah. And he's got a destination that he's taking you into. Hallelujah to God. Come on, one more time. Raise your hands and just thank God for being God in your life. See, you got to thank God like that. I'm not just a religious person coming to church, just doing religious things. God, before the world was, this, uh, 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 had me in his mind. God chose me in himself before the foundation of the world. I might be holy and without blame before him in love. Come on, Ephesians 1, 3. Yeah. He chose me in himself. Is that right? Yeah. I was. He said that I might be holy and without blame before him in love. God Lord. wanted me to uh, have a certain makeup, a look, a look like a certain thing uh, uh, before himself. Mm -hmm. And that wasn't a piece of dirt, no good sin, sinful thing. Or in God wanted us to look a certain way. Amen. Come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. God designed us to look a certain way. And then he said, he says, uh, that was in, uh, somebody said, timelessness. Amen. That was before time was, uh, not like the book of Genesis, when the Genesis says, in the beginning, God. Mm. No, not the beginning, but before the foundation of the world, God. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Anybody believe that God can be that big? Yeah. That he can exist before the foundation of the world? Yeah. That all yeah. things can come out of him? Yeah. Did you believe that? Yeah. And that in the beginning, God is the master architect, analyst, programmer. Come all on. Engineer. Engineer. All, all that. And before anything has ever been said or done, God is. Come on. Yeah. And so God... Uh, uh, um, it says that he chose us in himself before the foundation of the world. But then he goes on to say, uh, and then he chose us to be adopted in Jesus Christ. Let me tell you what that means. He chose us in himself before the foundation of the world, but he knew that he uh, at, at, that was in timelessness. Mm -hmm. But in time, so I say in time, in time. he was going to release us out of himself into a world. Mm. Come on, timelessness, timelessness. and in time. time. You were birthed of God before the foundation of the world, but in time you were released into the world mm -hmm. and adopted in Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm. God, you never got out of God's mind. Hallelujah. You were always on God's mind. Yes. Yes. And then he said, and you were walking around, you didn't know him, but he says, and whom he foreknew. Mm. Come on. Yeah. Them he also predestined. Yes. Yeah. 
Come on, you you didn't know him, but he knew you mm -hmm. because he placed yeah. destiny, his destiny down on the inside of you, yeah. and you were a carrier and didn't even know it. Yeah. Yeah. See, yeah. so when we say thank you, Lord, we're not just kind of doing religious thank yous. Mm -hmm. We're thanking God for the realization. Come on, yes. somebody do that yes. for just a moment. Yes. Yes. Thank yes. you, God, for the realization. Yes. For the realization. Yes. Listen, that doesn't change. Yes. Religion can change, but that won't change. Yes. That's not going to change. Is that right? But that's not even all of it. He says he chose us uh, to be adopted in Jesus Christ, that we should be to the praise of of the glory of his grace. Uh, the Holy Spirit now, after you've been uh, come to Jesus Christ or come back to God through Jesus Christ, the Holy Spirit is now your personal mentor. Mm -hmm. All right. he's, he, he's now bringing you from dimension to dimension of, of grace uh, concerning who you are. He's now revealing your identity, who you are. He's now re re revealing your purpose. Why are you here? He's now revealing your, 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 your potential. What can you accomplish? He's now re revealing, praise God, your destiny. Where are you going? And he's revealing, revealing your source. Uh, 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 where did I come from? The Holy Spirit is busy now bringing you into the Son of God that you always were. He has brought you into the system of, of total recall where you're understanding now who you were before the foundation of the world, who you are now, how you God came to get you, praise God. And now, praise God, you've got the Holy Spirit mentoring you. And guess what he's mentoring you for? Eternity. Yes. That's why we call it the everlasting gospel. It's yes. the good news before time began. It's the good news right now. And it's the good news that's going to be forever concerning you. Amen. Oh, can anybody believe it? Amen. Because yes. it yes. takes faith to believe this kind of gospel. Yes. Amen. Yes. It takes faith to believe this kind of gospel. But I want to I want to introduce you, praise God, to a few more principles, praise God, on today. Amen. In Jesus' name. Have you got 2 Peter chapter 1? 2 Peter chapter 1, and I'm going to read, praise God, uh, 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 down to verse 7. And it just give me a few minutes to talk about them, praise God. Simon Peter, a servant and an apostle of Jesus Christ, to them that have, to them that have obtained like precious faith with us through the righteousness of God and our Savior Jesus Christ. Grace and peace be multiplied unto you through the knowledge of God, and of Jesus our Lord, according as his divine power has given unto us all things that pertain to life and godliness, and through the knowledge of him that have called us to glory and virtue, whereby are given unto us exceeding great and precious promises, that by these you might be partakers of the divine nature." having escaped the corruption that is in the world through lust. And besides this, giving all diligence, add to your faith virtue, and to your virtue knowledge, and to your knowledge temperance, and to your temperance patience, and to your patience godliness, and to your godliness brotherly kindness, and to your brotherly kindness charity. For if these things be in you and abound, they make you that you shall, you shall neither be barren nor unfruitful in the knowledge of our Lord Jesus Christ. But he that lacketh these things is blind and cannot see afar off and have forgotten that he was purged from his old sins. Dear God, bless us. Uh, 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 note this 10th verse together. I told you I'd read the 7th, but just note this 10th verse also. Wherefore, the rather, brethren, give urge, give diligence to, to making your calling and your election sure. For if these things be in you, if you do these things, you shall never fall. Does anybody believe the word of God? Yes. Amen. Amen. That God would put, has the audacity to put something like this in scripture and uh, uh, saying that he's got a way that we shall never fall. Mm. He's got a way that we shall never fail. Mm. Come on, anybody believe that God can? Amen. God can do that, Amen. Yes. But will He do that? Mm. God can do that, but is He 
is he uh, so bold as to put these put it in the scripture as a promise that uh, he will do that? Let's look over these verses again that I've read. First verse says, uh, Simon Peter, a servant and apostle of Jesus Christ, to them that have obtained uh, uh, like precious faith. How many of you know that, that you have received like per precious faith of G like Jesus Christ says? Mm, yes. Did you see that in the scripture? Mm -hmm. Did, did yeah. I read that right? Yeah. He says, to them that have obtained what? Like, like precious faith. faith. Like precious faith. Now let's 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 settle that. Uh, either we have or we have not received the same valuable faith uh, 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 that Jesus Christ had, the same valuable faith that the first church, the apostles had. Mm. Come on, I know you were saying, oh, mm. but look at this going on and look at that going on. That's not what we're talking about. We're talking about the scripture and the truth. Mm. Have we received? Has it been made available to us like precious faith? Mm -hmm. Come on, somebody. Mm -hmm. yeah. Has that been yeah. made available to us? Yeah. Yeah. If it's been made available to us, yeah. give God a thank you. Amen. Thank you. Amen. 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 He has uh, obtained like precious faith with us through the righteousness of God and our Savior. Praise God. This is God, the God that always does the right thing. Mm -hmm. yes. Come on. This is the God that always. always I don't know. We, we, we serve. The, the, this is the God we serve. Amen. Mm -hmm. I'm not. I can't stand up here and talk about uh, somebody else's God. But I can talk about, I'm talking about our God and we as Christians, our God. Mm -hmm. the, the God who has given us like precious like faith. Precious. Yes. I, I, I went on a, a, a consecration uh, uh, at a certain time and I realized uh, during that consecration that I couldn't do it. Mm -hmm. yeah, I, just, I just got so weak. I mean, like, and I began to pray. I said, Holy Spirit, you've got to help me. Mm -hmm. Have you ever prayed and asked the Holy Spirit to help you mm -hmm. and you felt his help? Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Yes, yes. I, and, and that's what I felt. I felt it. His, I felt his help. I remember another time, praise God, I was going through some things, praise God, and being a part of the First Fruit family, uh, I, 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 I kind of get up early in the morning, praise God, and, and this morning I got up and I could feel strength. I could feel uh, 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 that that I didn't go I didn't get up the way that I, I laid down. You know what I realized? I realized what Paul had been saying about the saints that were praying for him. Amen. And he said that's turning into his strength. Yes. Praise God. Yes. How many of you know that praise God we've got like precious faith? Yes. Amen. yes. And, and, and and we serve the God, praise God. He says that yes. that, that uh, uh, we've obtained like precious faith uh, uh, with us through the righteousness of God and our Savior Jesus Christ. This is, the, this is what God has given to us. Look at verse 2. He says, Grace and peace be multiplied unto you through the knowledge of God and of Jesus our Lord. Yes. And we take that first uh, grace and peace, uh, multiplied grace and peace. That's, that's where we got our theme, so to speak, our, te uh, our title, uh, receiving multiplied grace and peace. But he says, Grace and peace be multiplied unto you yes. through the knowledge of God yes. and of Jesus Christ. Yes. Now, this word grace means, praise God, graciousness. Mm -hmm. How many know what graciousness is? Mm -hmm. Graciousness means acceptability. Mm -hmm. Come on, that you are accepted. Benefit mm -hmm. and favor. Grace mm -hmm. be multiplied to you mm -hmm. yes. through the knowledge. Yes. Acceptance. Favor. Mm -hmm. Come on now. I'm not talking religion. I'm talking about either the scripture is right or is not right. Mm -hmm. And we've got to begin to put those to put these things on our lips, praise God, as though they were right. Yes. The Bible yes. says that Amen. the Bible Thank says that uh, 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 it's impossible to please God without faith. Mm -hmm. You can't come to God thinking that you curse, praise God, when He said, mm -hmm. I've given you grace. Mm -hmm. yes. Come on now. Yes. I've, I've made you acceptable. Amen. Yes. I've got favor. I've got uh, 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 liberality. Come on, somebody. Yes. Bless the Lord for liberality. Amen. Yes. Come on. That God is a good God. Amen. Yes. So he says, grace be multiplied to you. Peace and peace 
be multiplied to you. And we've heard about peace so much in the body of Christ. We, one word we can say peace is, we're talking about prosperity. Yes. Peace, come on. It's the, it's the absence of this agitation that the life would bring to us. Come on. Yes. It's quietness and rest. Uh, mm -hmm. As we set our hearts upon upon the grace and peace is, is multiplied to us. Grace and peace has been made available. We've got access to multiplied grace and peace. Yes. It's like the person, it's like the person that's going through uh, something and depressed, praise God, and without the realizing that they are a fruit, they are fruit tree, uh, a fruit of jo the fruit of joy is on the tree of their life. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you heard what I just said. Mm -hmm. That all that's necessary is uh, uh, accessing uh, uh, what's been made available, and, 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 and if you can access what's been made available, you can begin to eat the fruit thereof. Yeah. Come on, is anybody Amen. understanding what I'm saying? Yeah. Is anybody understanding what I'm saying? Yeah. So, so see, grace and peace has been made available, and it's and that it is accessible. Look what he says: grace and peace be multiplied unto you through the knowledge of Jesus Christ our Lord. Peace and grace is multiplied. Multiplied is to increase, abound, and and, and, and when we say through our Lord Jesus Christ, we're talking about our, our focus is fixed on him. Amen. Our, our focus is, we know that where it's come, we know where our help comes from. Mm -hmm. Praise God, we're not running around trying to find our help in any and everything. Amen. Because we know where our help comes from. We have an Old Testament brother who says, I'll look to the hills Amen. from where my help Amen. comes from. Amen. So he says, through, it comes through something. Oh, come on, somebody get that in your head for just a moment. It comes through a certain way. Yes. Grace and multiplied peace. More uh, 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 grace, favor, acceptability, uh, peace, more uh, 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 abundance uh, in terms of uh, uh, the, the, the wealth of life, joy, and all of these things. It be multiplied to us through. There's an avenue that it comes from. Come on, somebody. Yes. There's an avenue. Settle that in our mind. Let's get right with spiritual concepts and ideas and principles. Yes. It doesn't work unless we work yes. it. Because yeah, yeah. even when you raise your hand, yeah. praise God, you're trying to get something through. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. You're trying to get something yeah. through. Somebody say, well, that's just works. It's not works. It's principles of spiritual, uh, uh, spirit, our spiritual existence, principles of the kingdom. You can't even, the uh, uh, Bible says, you say to a mountain, you say, oh, I got to say it. Well, it's the principle of the kingdom. Yeah. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Amen. Amen. Come on, yeah. somebody. Yeah. And, that, and, and, and that's just the way it is. Amen? Amen. Come on, that's, that's just the way, the way it is. is. is that, yeah. If you is. work it, it works. Is that right? Yeah. And you say that. Are you trying to get a formula, Apostle? Well, it is a formula. Mm -hmm. Love the Lord with all your heart. Mm -hmm. Praise God. He'll give you what? Come on, the desires of our heart. Amen? Amen? It is a formula. It works here. How many times? Oh, Why? Because it's a spiritual principle. It's the way it is. If you could open, if God would give, uh, uh, open our discernment and we began to see in the spirit realm to see how it works, we would see that's the way it works every time. Amen? All right, so it, it, it says through the knowledge. Well, somebody uh, 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 just began to realize that it's important to get some knowledge. Amen. Come on now. Amen. I just want to shout when I go to church. Amen. I just want to feel good when I go to church. I just want to, you know, mm -hmm. hit come behind when I go to church. Mm -hmm. But how I many of you know that, praise God, we need some knowledge. Yes. Amen. Come on now. Amen. Knowledge is going to show us the way. Come on. Amen. Amen. The Bible says, all you're getting, get understanding. understanding. Wisdom, uh, uh, understanding is a, a, a principle. Wisdom is principle. Praise God. Now you know we need it. Yes. Amen. Yeah. Amen. Glory to God. Glory to God. Grace and peace be multiplied to us through the knowledge, through the recognition. 
How many recognize this as the word yeah. of God? Yeah. How many recognize that there's a kingdom way? Yeah. That yeah. You were born into it. You didn't know you were born way. into it, but you were born into it. Is that yeah. right? Yeah. You were born into a situation, praise God, uh, 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 of left hand and right hand. Mm -hmm. You were born into a situation of good and bad. Mm -hmm. You were yes. born into a situation of negative and positive. It didn't matter if you think or like or felt like it or not. That's just the way it is. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. You were born into that situation. Amen? Amen. 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 But, the, and that's, but through this acknowledgement, through this recognition, mm -hmm. through this the resting in the truth, mm -hmm. the Bible says you can enter into uh, 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 that which has made available to us in terms of grace and peace. Mm -hmm. yes. Somebody thank God for just a moment. Yes. Yes. Grace and peace is, is mine. Mm -hmm. Verse 3 says, according as his divine power has given unto us all things that all pertain to life and God, God. through things. the knowledge of him that have called us unto glory and faith. Uh, glory and virtue. He says, according to, as his divine power. How I many you know that Jesus Christ operated under divine power? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And how I many you know he still operates in yeah. divine power? Yeah. Yes. You got you to gotta make your mind up whether you believe this. Mm -hmm. Jesus, according as his divine power. This is, this is uh, uh, what the Bible says that Jesus uh, 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 operated in. Mm -hmm. uh, it was a godly Power, and the Bible says that that we receive a uh, uh, power after the Holy Spirit has come. Uh, it says of Jesus Christ that that He operated in a certain kind of power. Amen. Come on, uh, Jesus operated. You think you operating in a dunamis? Mm. Jesus <laughs> operated in a power. Come on, somebody, get it, believe it, or leave it alone. Come on, somebody. I believe that he operated in a power, Dr. Yes. Cooper. I believe that he operated in a power. Yes. He says, according as his divine power yes. has given. Somebody say, has given. Has given. given us. Has given unto us. His mm. divine power has given unto us, has made available unto us, yes. has Oh, this is spiritual yeah. concepts that it, yeah. that it takes faith to believe. It's yeah. out there and it's for us. Jesus ministered and he, he taught the people. He said, listen, the kingdom of God is at hand. Yes. What was he saying? Yeah. It's within reach. Yeah. Yeah. It's available. It's available. Yeah. But our endeavor then is not just uh, 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 knowing that it's at hand. Our endeavor is to have this relationship with the Holy Spirit to the extent that we see that thing pass from the heavens into our life. Yeah. Well, somebody just praise Amen. God. Yes. How, how many believe that things can yes. pass from the heavens into your life? Yes. 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 Uh, we can, if, you, if you stand up, praise God, in a, in a room, praise God, and you lift up your hands and begin to worship God, and it seems like the, the atmosphere is changed, that means that the Something in the atmosphere, the earthly atmospheres, has given way to something heavier. I mean, uh, heaven is bursting through mm. the curtains of the natural into the. Oh, was somebody just blessing? Yes. Yes. It's possible. Yes. It's real for us. It's not yes. just religion. It's real. Is that right? Yes. We don't. We don't. Oh, it's a miracle. It's, no, no, it's not. It's our natural. Come on, say amen. Yes. It's our natural. Come on now. Yes. Right. It's our natural. Right. As right. sons and daughters of God, we're not wrestling, praise God, to get saved. We're, we're wrestling to grow in these things. Amen. And the earth is about Amen. to see, uh, Bishop so Terry, the earth is about to see some sons and daughters of God like they ain't never seen before. Amen. Who have had 2,000 years of training, who have 2,000 years of upbringing, and they know some things about Scripture. They're not even arguing with people no more. But they're going behind the scenes and, and they're saying, uh, Satan in Jesus name Amen. I don't give you a place of operation in that area Amen. I stand Amen. in your way Amen. come on now Amen. Amen. <laughs> I stand in your way I said praise God we don't even we don't even waste our time arguing with people anymore there's no need for that you can't do that but I tell you what we can go in the spirit realm I remember praying for the Ukraine and, and, and uh, Russia now y'all this might not be your testimony but it's mine but I was declaring confusion you know I was kind of declaring that because in the Bible the Bible said there was an Old Testament warfare praise God where God confused 
use the yes. armies yes. of the enemy. Yes. Yes. He says, see, it's just a matter yes. sometimes of knowing, praise God, how the, how God, I, yes. I, 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 I was a chaplain, I could go over there, you know, they teach me a little bit about how to use the yes. rifle, but if I went over there, I'd be doing the same thing in the spirit realm, talking about, talking about God, deal with it from here. Yes. And you say, Bishop, said, we up here looking down, amen, yes. on these situations. Yes. Glory to God. Hallelujah to God. Amen. amen. His yes. divine power has yes. given unto us. Watch this now. Amen. All things that pertain to life unto God. Yes. Has give, given unto us all things that pertain unto life and God. How many things? All, all things. things. Now you got to catch that in the spirit realm. I know you're probably saying, well, in the natural, I don't see myself with all things. I don't, I don't have all things. But you got to understand in the spirit. See, Jesus is... Uh, the Bible says God has given him a name above every name, yes. that at his name every knee will bow, mm -hmm. tongue confess that he's Lord to the glory of God. Lord means that he's the landlord, he's the yeah. owner, he's Adonai. Oh, and uh, yeah. so the thing is, is this, there's nothing, according to the scriptures now, above him, right? Yeah. His throne yeah. means that his authority is above. And he says, if you overcome, he says, I'll cause you to be seated with me in my throne as I am been seated together with my father in his throne. What is that saying? Simply spoken is saying that he'll give you the authority. He'll let you exercise okay. in the authority that he exercises in. Amen. Bible said he can make us into kings, queens, and priests. Mm -hmm. Come on, say amen, somebody. Yes, amen. He can make us above and not beneath. Yes. He can make us heads and not tails. Yes. Will somebody and will somebody help in this place? Yes. He can. That's that. That's yes. the scripture for us. Now listen, yes. you're not going to enter into that by just praise God hearing it. It's just a preach sermon. Praise God. You're going to have to open your mouth and begin to declare it. Come on, say amen, somebody. Yes. Amen. And you're going to have to open your mouth and declare it. And you're going to have to you're going to have to labor to enter into it. Come on, somebody, we're laboring to enter into a rest now. Is that right? Yeah. You say, I don't have to labor for nothing. Jesus paid, paid it all. Well, no, if you, 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 you probably operate at a certain level of the Holy Spirit and never enter into any, any, any great places that he needs you to regarding working for him in this vineyard. Is that right? And you probably will get uh, uh, beat up pretty bad by the devil if you don't labor to enter into some of the higher things. Amen? Yes. Amen. Come on, amen? amen? Amen. And that's just the way it is also, praise God. So it says, he, he, uh, 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 His divine power has given unto us all things. I need to leave that, but praise God, I just I just love it so much because praise God is a good place to, 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 to cause my, to stimulate my thank you. You know, I mean, I, you know, sometimes we just, the yeah. pastor, the pastor says, say thank you. Everybody say thank you. But I'm saying, I, I tell you, when I learn the grace of God, say, I'll give you water that you never thirst again. Yes. Yes. And then when he said, and he just said, say, look, I made you. I designed you. I, I released you and called you to be a doctor. The Holy Spirit is now mentoring you. You were mine. You are mine. You're always going to be mine. Listen. I just began to thank God and can't stop. Yes. Can you see that? Yes. I, you you talk about stuff. where I'm That's going, or if I'm going, or how I'm going. That's I know stuff. where I am right now. Yes. I know where I am right now. Mm -hmm. Amen? His yes. divine power has given to all things, given us all things that pertain to life and God. As we have a covenant with God. I love it. Yeah, Come I love on, it. somebody. Amen. 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 Yes. Amen. And that's where we reside. We yes. rejoice in that covenant. Yes. God, yes. I have a covenant with yes. you. I praise you. You said me and my house can, can oh, receive the blood. Yes. I stand, I, I erect, uh, praise God, an altar in my life. Those things connected to me. God, and I thank you. Now, I need fire to come down on this altar. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and did you see my cousin in this altar? to God? Did you see my drunk uncle in this all altar, right, God? Right. I'm standing before you yes. and I said, this altar cannot live, cannot be a, 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 a unholy before you. This mm -hmm. altar has got mm -hmm. to are you, are you seeing what I'm saying, sis? Yes. Are you seeing what I'm saying, sis? Yeah. I'm talking about I want fire to come on this come altar. On yeah. What is my altar? Listen, I'm a meeting place between God come and on. praise God. I'm a meeting yes. place with God. Come yes. on, say amen, somebody. Yes. But you got to yes. take it some accountability and responsibility. Yes. God said, I made you into kings, queens, priests. You take responsibility over your altar. Come on, say amen. Yes. amen. Yes. You take it. You get, you, get, <laughs> you get to the place where you say, say 
Satan, you can't have it. Mm. Come on, say that. Come on, say that. Come on. Satan, you can't have it. I don't know. I don't know. Y'all don't, don't have conditions like I have. Praise God. Y'all don't have devils coming at your stuff like coming after mine. Praise God. Y'all don't have devils coming at your family like coming after mine. But praise God. I, I mean, I, I had to get up in the morning. I get emotional all by myself. I'm going through spiritual warfare. I'm putting you down. I'm stepping on you. Come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. Glory amen. to God. See, because amen. you got to understand that your natural life is a reflection of your spiritual life. Amen. Come on now. Amen. You get you just get agitated on the inside in the spirit, praise amen. God. You just get uh, 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 heated or warmed in the spirit. Yeah. Uh, uh, something's going to come out of you, yeah. praise yes. God. Yeah. That's going to push the devil yeah. back. Yes. Yes. That's what I'm asking about. Yeah. 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 You know what? I, 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 I said, well, I'm like you. I have said to myself, oh, no, God, why don't you just get rid of that rascal? Why we got to go through all of this? Why we got to go through all of this, God? And I, I guess it's just like y'all said, that God is bringing us to that place of maturity. And that's okay, amen? Because why? Adam could have gotten to maturity. Come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. Adam could have gotten to maturity. Yeah. He just didn't yeah. give it. Uh, he didn't, uh, there were some things that he was ignorant about, didn't know he was ignorant. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. There were some things he was ignorant about, didn't yeah. know he was ignorant. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. And he went ahead and did what he shouldn't have done. Yeah. Praise God. He did certain power. Well, if you think that's something, um, just get, just look here for just a few more minutes. Uh, all that stuff will come to us through the knowledge of him that have called us unto uh, glory and virtue. Verse 4, whereby given unto us exceeding great and precious promises that by these you might be partakers of the divine nature, having escaped the corruption that is in the world through lust. How many know what a divine nature is? How many know what a divine nature is? Now he already said, he already said in uh, uh, a few verses up that that uh, 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 that, that According as Jesus, Jesus, according as his divine power, mm -hmm. Jesus had divine power. Is that right? Mm -hmm. But guess what he'll do with that divine power? He'll bring you into a divine nature. Yes. Mm -hmm. Listen, I don't know who you think you are. If you think you're just flesh and blood and bone and that's mm -hmm. all there is to you. But the Bible says that God is, God is designed to bring you into a divine nature. Yes. Whereby given to us exceeding great and precious promises, that by these promises you might be a partaker of a divine nature. Oh, and my mm -hmm. God. Yes. Ooh, Lord. Mm -hmm. A divine nature. Come on, I'll never die. Praise God. Mm -hmm. Pass from life to life. Come on, say amen. Come on, amen. A divine nature. You see, I think sometimes we're a little scared to walk in these things, too. Mm -hmm. We're a little scared what people think if we begin to say stuff like this. And I know what you're feeling, amen. Praise God. But it's the truth anyhow, amen. amen. It's the truth anyhow, amen. amen. I'm getting to the place now. I'm, getting, I'm just too old to kind of be messing with people. <laughs> and, uh, I, need my, I need my divine nature. Come on. I need my divine nature. Amen. He says, according to, uh, he said, whereby is given unto us. Again, he says, it's given unto us, made yeah, available, yeah. exceeding, exceeding great and precious promises. Mm -hmm. How many got a covenant with God? Yes. That by these, you might be a, a, a partaker of the divine nature, having escaped the corruption that is in the world through lust. Let me take one minute to help you to understand the entire Bible. One minute, okay? okay. And he says that you have escaped the corruption mm -hmm. that is in the world through lust. Mm -hmm. Let me say it again, because some of your, uh, your the, the pet demons is just fighting that and getting in your ear. Mm -hmm. Watch it again. That we have in, the promises help us to escape the corruption. You know, the word corruption means the decay. The destroyer, the destroyer comes. You, you know, you put, I put that on my notes this morning. We have escaped the decay that is in the world. Yeah. You remember when Jesus told his disciples, you are the salt of the earth? Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
He said, the corruption mm -hmm. is like a piece of meat, praise God, a cow or something like that, slaughtered, mm -hmm. but not, uh, what's the word? Preserved. Preserved. You, you use salt and preserve oh, it. Yeah. preserve it. And decay sets in it, and it begins to rotten, stink, go bad, yeah. little by little. Yeah. So when the Bible says you have escaped the corruptions, mm -hmm. it's saying you have escaped a decay process mm -hmm. that is in the world. Mm -hmm. yes. Yes. A decaying process that yes. is in the world. Yes. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Yes. Hallelujah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Amen. But here's the mystery. Yeah. Through lust. Mm. Mm. If, you, if you learn but just that one thing right there, that God is love and Satan is lust. Amen. Yeah. If you learn about one thing yeah. that the decay process exists right. because of lust. Mm -hmm. The destroyer. Yeah. The destroyer. Yeah. And so you wonder why you wonder why we are uh, 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 you wonder why we are promoting that lust because lust doesn't care if it's a tree, a ground, a dog, a cat. Mm -hmm. uh, lust is not necessarily sex. It could be it could be too much pork. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Chocolate chip, chocolate chip cookies. <laughs> you know, so <laughs> I, I, I didn't know. Was... Chocolate with almonds. <laughs> Oh. We're gonna have to do. We're gonna have to do a deliverance service. <laughs> 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 But the bottom line is this. We found an answer right here. A co the corruption process is in the world through lust. Do you know what happened to Adam and Eve? Eve came and saw the tree, and the Bible says, uh, uh, it was, it, God says don't do it, but when she looked at it, it looked like it was good for food. Yeah. And knowledge. So, but first of all, let's just deal with that. It yeah. means that her flesh began to desire something that God said don't. Yeah. That's the what do we call that? Loss of the flesh. Yeah. 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 Yes. She, she began to look at it, and as she looked at it, it began to be it began it, 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 it pleasant to the eyes. Uh, uh, you know, it, 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 what is that? Lust of the eye. Yes. Mm. When she looked at the tree, it, it was what? Something that she felt like could make somebody wise. Mm -hmm. What is that? Pride of life. Pride of life. Mm -hmm. So you're talking about yeah. the, the same way he operated in the beginning is the way he's operating now. Right. But the key is that we, if we knew nothing else in the Bible, the corruption process is in the earth. Come on. Wow. Through right. lust. Through yeah. Yeah. So when we're looking at TV and God is saying, change that channel. Yeah. Yeah. Or turn it on. Amen. Come Amen. on. All right. When we're looking at TV and God says, don't look at that. Mm -hmm. And you, you know, you done got so hard now. You, 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 know, you don't even hear it. I mean, you hear it, but you know. And you know it's God. Because it, it, mm -hmm. lust and love are incompa incompatible. Yeah. Mm -hmm. John, in the book of First John, says, all that's in the world is the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eye, the pride of life. When Satan came to Jesus, he said, Jesus, turn this uh, uh, rocks into bread, lust of the flesh. Uh, uh, Jesus, jump off this thing right here, because uh, God will uh, cause you not to dash your foot against a stone. Uh, 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 Jesus says, I can't tempt God, pride of life. Jesus, look at, I'll show you all the things of the world. Uh, I'll give it to you also, because it's given to me. I can give to anybody I want to. What's that? Loss of the eye. Mm -hmm. Same thing it came with Adam and Eve. It came to uh, uh, Jesus. And then John picked it up and said, here's what it is, y'all. Loss of the flesh, loss of the eye, blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. So here he says, uh, here we say again, corruption is in the world through lust. And we have escaped. Come on, somebody say, I've escaped. I've escaped. I've escaped. It ain't easy. Man. Mm -hmm. 
Bible says Moses refused to enjoy the pleasures of sin for a season in the house of Pharaoh. He, he separated himself. It ain't easy, y'all. We live in a world, praise God. We live in a world that's intentionally, on purpose, uh, uh, trying to uh, uh, deceive. And you gotta, you gotta consider why is it that these people are trying to, in, in deliberately, on purposely, to deceive and 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 and, and pervert. I'm not calling nobody nothing. Do what you want. I don't care. You can kiss the statue out there if you want to. But I, I, I'm going to pray for you and love you anyway. Mm -hmm. you, know, you, do you see what I'm saying? But I'm talking about these, these traits. Mm -hmm. that operate, uh, uh, they come from the spirit world. Love and lust. Mm -hmm. Amen. Yes. We got to be strong. Come on, somebody yes. say, be sober. Because so lust is not your friend. Amen. Amen. Yes. Come on, lust is not your friend. Amen. Amen. Come on, it may come. The Bible says in the book of uh, Proverbs, says, uh, be careful how you go down to that strange woman's house. And you, you've been talking to women, we be, be careful how you go to that strange. He said, because her ways lead down yeah. into hell. Mm. Come on, somebody. Yes. Come on, somebody. So he says, praise God, uh, 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 the corruption that's in the world is in the world through lust. Yes. My God, how many are going to be free forever now? Yes. Come on now, you ain't got to be free. You, you, I, I, I would say you ain't got to be. You might be all free all at once, but I may know that, praise God, you can get free. Amen. 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 You can work on it. Is that right? Yes. I'm still working on it, man. I'm still working on it. Coming here and being here a few days with Bishop Sauteris, all that coffee he tempted me to drink, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. Man. I don't know. <laughs> you know? But, the, but I mean, uh, I, t I told him, I said, I'm, I'll, I'll repent. I'll get free. I'll get free. Come on, say amen, somebody. See, you got to learn not to condemn yourself also. Because you're going you're gonna to slip. God told me one time, stop comparing yourself to everybody. Right. Right. Some people are stronger in certain areas than you are. Amen. Glory to God. And my, my wife is strong when it comes to uh, certain things. I'm not. And especially when it, I would be watching that TV. She coming there fussing and turn that. I die. I'm, I'm getting mad. <laughs> you know, I'm the only one like that. I <laughs> but I'm getting there. Come on. I'm getting there. Yes, I am. The stuff I used to, when I first got married, I used to love horror movies. I mean, who, what kind of crazy is that that you going to scare yourself? Right. <laughs> <laughs> but we're deceived into thinking that that's something, you know, desirable. Yeah. Right? That's not desirable. And faith, faith will mess, I mean, excuse me, fear will mess up your faith. Yeah. Fear will mess up your faith. Yeah. But, but uh, uh, I just say on this point, just one, just, just a minute, because we need to get that phrase, corruption is in the world through lust. Decay is in the world through lust. Satan, and I did the same thing which, which, you, which you spoke of. When I t taking my notes this morning, I said, uh, destruction uh -huh. is in the world through lust. D I said, destruction, that's the destroyer. Yeah. Mm. That's the modern day, the that's scripture true. call him Abaddon or Apollyon. Mm. Yeah. It's a destroying devil that's in the world. Yes. Yes. And it's not a little devil, it's a big devil. Yes. Yes. Amen? Yeah. Come on, so so uh, what are we talking about here? Uh, uh, we're talking about we know that we've come to a certain place, but the scripture says now, I want you to add to mm. your bit. Taking all diligence, add some things onto your faith. All right, all right. Come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. 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 He didn't say go out and condemn nobody else and fuss with everybody Ooh. else. He says, he says now, now you you come this far and you you, you you but now add be diligent to add to your faith. Yes. Come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. I know we thought amen. we had already made it. Praise God, we were already there. And I, please don't take it as though we're talking about uh, 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 legalism. Well, you got to do this to be saved. You're saved if you accepted Jesus Christ, amen. as far as I know. Amen? amen. And, uh, but what God is saying to us is that, praise God, God just doesn't want us saved. Amen. God wants us to, to overcome. Amen. Yes. How many of yes. you know, praise God? Amen. If I took if I if I took something right here and threw it down on the floor and and, and, it, and that means it, it and it fell to the floor and praise God and I, then I picked it up off the floor and I moved it back right here I moved it back right here uh, have I restored it? Who said that? I did. 
Not fully. Is that right? I picked it up and I put it right here. Why? Because it was originally right here. Right. I mean, no, you can't know what restoration even is unless you know where you originally was. Mm -hmm. Amen. 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 See, so people tell me the Bible is, I know what the will of God is. I know what it is too, restoration of humanity. Mm -hmm. Come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. 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 Restoration. Absolutely. We've been 2,000 years in training to get to this point. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. There's some more to go. How do I know there's some more to go? Revelations 10. Uh, uh, it says that there was a, uh, a book that came down and a book had uh, was, was about to be opened. And God said, shut up the book. Don't even open it up right now. Uh -huh. Seven thunders uttered their voices. John was about to write. God said, shut it up. Don't even write it. Uh -huh. That lets us know that there's still more. Yes. Yes. Come on, say amen. amen. There's still more. Yeah. Is that right? Yeah. And so we're, we're moving towards, uh, and that keeps us humble too. Mm -hmm. Keeps us humble. Yes, okay. Amen. Yeah. There's more. We're going to grab a hold to it. Come on, say somebody. I'm going to grab a hold to the more. Yeah. Okay, I'm just about finished. Praise God. I'm just about finished. Uh, where was that one? I said, where was I? I talked about um, just now. Uh, the fourth, the fourth verse. Okay, whereby given unto us great and precious promise that you might be partakers of the divine nature, having escaped the corruption that's in the world through lust. Amen. Mm -hmm. and, and besides this, come on. And besides this, besides this, besides this, besides this, besides this, giving all diligence. Uh -huh. I mean, I know what diligence is. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I know what diligence is. Yes. Giving all diligence. It means uh, right alongside your faith, uh -huh. give diligence uh -huh. to add to your faith. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. Come on. Is that what it said? It did say. It's not talking to unbelievers, is it? No. It's no. not talking about newborn babes, is it? No. It's in, and, 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 and giving all diligence. Yeah. Uh, giving all um uh, or you're saying simultaneously while your faith is building up, add to your faith. Mm -hmm. Come on, somebody. Mm -hmm. I believe the scripture says, add to your faith. Mm -hmm. I believe the scripture says, add to your faith. Mm -hmm. Come on now, we can't, uh, we can't uh, uh, apostle, we can't be uh, 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 calling all of uh, our members can't be calling us talking about, uh, Apostle, I don't have no faith. They got to add to your faith. Is that right? Amen. Come on, we got to begin to talk to people about add to your faith. Now, I can't, that's not talking about nominal Christianity. People who just like to go to church on Sunday and Wednesday and then that's it. Might not never pick up the Bible during the week. They don't have a prayer life, praise God, or anything like that. Uh, we're talking about people who are like y'all. I mean, y'all, I'm, I'm shocked in this place right here. Uh, I'm, talking, I'm talking about people that's ready to add to their faith. Yes. Yes. Add into our faith. What's going to happen if we add to our faith? You get virtue. Something's about to happen, amen? Yeah. He says, add to your faith, praise God. Yeah. Giving all diligence to do that. He says, praise God, uh, y'all know what add means. That's where we get that. Uh, I know that uh, multiplication don't come out of addition, but mm -hmm. that's all right. We know if we add, we can, we can get over to multiplication somehow. Is that right? Mm -hmm. We know it's going to be increases, all right? Yes. Add to our faith, praise God, uh, 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 virtue. Uh -huh. virtue. Virtue is what? Valor. Valor. Mm -hmm. Come on, excellence. Yes. Amen. Come on, praise. Mm -hmm. yeah. honor. Add, add honor. Yeah. Yeah. Add to your faith amen. virtue. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. 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 We, we, we've been given a formula for faith. Praise God. Just say it and, and say it and, and, and get it to, you know, blame it and, and, and don't have to do nothing else. Just say, add some virtue in your spirit. So yeah. I mean a wishy-wash, a jelly bag, a, a, mm -hmm. you know, a, a, a wind that everything can blow down. Come on, say amen, somebody. Amen. When the wind blow, you stand up and say, no, I'm a, my faith will not be weak. Amen. My faith will not be strong. Valor is courageous. Courageous. Yeah. Yes. Come on. Add to your faith. Yes. Courage. Yes. Valor. Yes. Honor. Yes. Come on, somebody. That which is excellent. Yes. Come on. 
and to your virtue adds what? Knowledge. Knowledge. Yes. And this is one that the, 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 uh, uh, the first century church got a little confused about because that word means, the, the Greek is, is a word called gnosis. And gnosis is, a, is where we had uh, the people called the Gnostics who believed in secret knowledge, mm -hmm. hidden mysteries mm -hmm. and whatnot. So, and it also means science. Mm -hmm. So he says, add to your virtue uh, knowledge. And that means some knowing. Mm -hmm. It means, I hate to say, say it because some of y'all might not like it, some science. Mm -hmm. God doesn't like no science. No, God like common sense. I would say that. Oh, man, I can see y'all looking at me like a cow looking at Newgate. <laughs> I didn't think I'm going through there about something. <laughs> yeah, he said, add to your faith. Uh, he says, add to your virtue some, some, uh, some knowing. Some knowing. And that word uh, has some... It, let me see, oh, I got a scripture somewhere. Give it to add to your faith. Uh, uh, some knowledge, some gnosis, some knowing, some, 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 some uh, 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 there's falsely called science, but then there's science that's for real. Yes, ma'am. I was going to say, in, 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 when the Bible speaks of knowledge, and we, and we say the Greek is gnosis, but it has the, it has the connotation of intimacy. When we think of Genesis and Adam knew, it means that he, he conjugated that love, mm -hmm. and that love became one. So in, in knowing God, there is a sense of oneness. There is a sense of completeness. We are conjugating our love for him in the highest spiritual form. So when we know him, yeah. these things grow out of that type. It's not book learning. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's, a, it's a deeper sense of that. See, she's talking, I ain't talking about, um, uh, what's that? Not Scientology, mm -hmm. but spiritual science. That's spiritual science. Mm -hmm. that, that if you do thus, such and such will take up. Well, you want to call it cause and effect or whatever? I call it divine copulation. Divine copulation. Mm -hmm. But that's that's spiritual science. Yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah, Come on, does that make sense? Yeah. Yes. Amen. It, 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 it is real too, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. All right, so add to your faith some knowledge. If you don't know anything about uh, uh, but knowing, add to your virtue, add to your faith virtue and to your virtue knowledge. And then to your knowledge, add what? Self-control self or temperance. Self-control or te temperance. Mainly that word is dealing with continuance. Mm -hmm. Have a spirit of continuance yes, that yes. you believe in, con that, that, that nothing is easily stops you and breaks you down from just moving forward in the things of life. Add to your faith. Here's seven or eight different things here you want to, look up, you want to study, and you want to take some time, praise God, to just kind of uh, 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 unravel. Mm -hmm. Come on, amen? amen? Because God has said that at the end, we already read what it's going to say, and that is, if these things be in you, mm -hmm. you shall never fail. Never. Yeah. Hallelujah! Say, amen. Hallelujah. I don't believe it's just a place that God used to feel, put filled words in. Mm -hmm. I believe it's something to this. Yes, it is. Amen? Yes, it is. And I believe for us, uh, it's for us who are, are people who are uh, not just seeking the hand of God, but the face of the Holy Spirit. There's, uh, there's our next level is in this. Yes. Yes. Amen. Amen. Yeah. I mean, there's our, our next level is is in this. So add to your add to your temperance what, patience. Mm -hmm. Amen. What's patience? Uh, hopeful endurance. Mm -hmm. I like that. Come on. Amen. Hopeful endurance. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Uh, uh, if you want to just make it plain, waiting. Yeah. Learn how to wait on God. Yes. Yes. Just Learn how to wait, wait. on God. Wait. Yeah. wait with joy. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. Amen. Yeah. Praise God. And then add to your patience what? Godliness. Mm -hmm. What's that? Uh, holiness. Mm -hmm. Yes. Piety. Yeah. I know somebody gonna call you. You know, you say you so religious and all that. Yes. That's what they're gonna say about you because you you you, you, you carry your piety. I mean, you carry your, your, your holiness. He said, man, I don't, I'm not watching that. Uh, I'm not, you know, going to the movies to, to do that. Or I'm not engaging in that. 
How many of you know, praise God, we keep ourselves? Yes. 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 Amen. Come on, amen. Yes. amen. Yes. See, because the, those other things are not our friends. Yes. Amen. They, they, they look and they seem like fun, but they'll string you out. Uh, once, you, once you get out of there. So, so add to your patient godliness, holiness. I'm going through these kind of fast. You, 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 you go back and you pick them out again and go over them. And then to your godliness, add some what? Some brotherly kindness. Yeah. <coughs> add some Philadelphia to it. Yeah. Yeah. Amen? <laughs> some brotherly That's kindness. Right. Yeah. And, and that just means fraternal affection. Yeah. Brotherly love amongst yeah. each other. Right? Yeah. Come on, you have some have some fraternal affection to each other. Yeah. I know you love, praise God, drunk Uncle Johnny, but hey man, how much do you love your peoples? Yeah. Come on, amen. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. I told my wife, I said, I'm so glad we came to uh, 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 Conyers, and I just said, I told you, I marvel at the love of, the, of these bro this brother and sister for oh, yeah. for the body. Yes. I marvel yes. at their Loving. love. Loving. And, yes. and, 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 and really, something clicked inside of me. He said, I got to do better. Yeah. I got to do better. How many know we don't, love we don't always just really me love too. everybody? Yeah. 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 Oh, I know y'all. Y'all <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <Yeah. laughs> just yeah. good. Y'all <laughs> left your wings in the car and all that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still working. Yeah. I'm not Steve Harvey now. I'm not, yeah. But I'm still working on some things. Amen. Yeah. But he says, and. <laughs> To your godliness, brotherly yeah. kindness, brotherly yeah. love. Yes. yes. My God. If we would love anybody, we'd love the, the body of Christ. Oh, yeah. I mean, we yes. see a man of God going out praying for people in the grocery store and people getting up healed, but yet we'll walk away jealous or uh, you ain't you better watch out. Be, you better be careful instead of love. Here, yeah, man, here's a man, I mean, I say that one. Here, yeah, man, here's 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 some help. Come on, say amen, somebody. <laughs> amen. <laughs> I think we were talking about that disconnect today, praise God. Uh, uh, we need to be pushing each other in the, in the right direction in these, in these days. Amen? amen? Everybody's not designed to be behind the pulpit. Amen. We don't need everybody behind the pulpit. Amen. There's some people, praise God, we need. We, uh, we need uh, Sister Jackson and uh, 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 you know, our uh, uh, judges and whatnot. Mm -hmm. Amen. Praise God. Yeah. They, they people taking back stuff that we won 50 years ago, they're taking yeah. it back. Amen. Yeah. The laws are changing. Hallelujah. You know, so the, 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 we don't need everybody in the pulpit. Amen. Right? We need some Amen. brotherly Spread love, out. brother. Yeah. Oh, they, they just drug addicts over there. Yeah. I, don't, I ain't got nothing to do with them. I mean, you know, you better be careful because me end up in a drink mm -hmm. at, at somebody's party and mm -hmm. somebody else's family and all that. Uh, I'm going too far with that. But brotherly <laughs> kindness. <laughs> brotherly kindness, amen. Uh -huh. Come on, brotherly kindness, brotherly amen. Kindness. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Then add to your brotherly kindness what? Charity. A love. Wow. love Come on, add to your brotherly kindness just through some pure love, amen. Yeah. Amen. 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 Affection yeah. and uh some passion for, for for each other. For these things be in you and abound, Come they on. make you that you should neither be barren nor unfruitful in the knowledge of Jesus Christ. If these things be in you, I don't know about you, but I received these this morning in my own prayer time. I'm going to research these some more, man. Because I want to, I failed enough in life. I've skipped and missed it enough. And this says that there's a possibility something's available that can cause me uh, to not be unfruitful and to, uh, and to not fail. Mm -hmm. Verse 9, nine the last verse will do. It says, but he that lacketh these things is blind. Mm -hmm. oh. Amen. That might be a disconnect right there. Mm -hmm. He that lacketh these things is blind. How many know we got faith but a lot of these other things we don't have. Yeah. Come on, we got faith, yeah. but we don't like each other. Each other. Yeah. Come on. We got faith, praise God, uh, uh, but we sure don't have no patience. Yeah. We got faith, but we can't wait on nothing. No temperance, amen? Yeah. We got faith, but we sure are not virtuous. And so, praise God, uh, God's saying, let's add some stuff to that faith. Yeah. Amen. He said that he that lacketh these things is blind. Yeah. and cannot see afar off mm -hmm. and have forgotten that he was once Forgiven. purged that he was purged oh, yeah. from his old sins yeah. 
Okay, how many how many know that you've been purged? Amen. 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 Good. Lift up your heart for to the Lord. I'm, I'm finished with the scripture in just a moment. Stand on your feet, by the curb, if you will, in Jesus' name. Amen. In Jesus. No, 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 not everybody. Just stick. Like Dr. Cruz, just stand up right there. Lift your hands up in Jesus' name. Come on, we're going to pray. We're going to pray. Y'all pray with me. Amen. 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 In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. Mm. Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Thank you, Jesus. 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 Sometimes in difficult situations or reports that are not that great, we have to, oh, come on, now. right there, there it is. Yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Now the Spirit of the Lord is upon you, Dr. Cooper. Ah. Jesus, I'm going to speak. I'm going to speak a word of deliverance and a word of healing. I'm going to speak a deliverance and a word of healing in Jesus' name. Come on, receive. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Come on, come on, come on. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Come on, keep praying for just a few moments here. She's standing in the gap for her daughter. She's standing in the gap for her home. Come on now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. That's the Holy Ghost. We're going to say, I receive. We're going to say, I receive. I receive. Okay, that's the Holy Spirit. You are great. You are miraculous. You are wonderful. You are the praise of God because you are able. You are good. What you do is good. Sing praise to God. Praise to God. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay. Okay, hello. 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 Let's pray a little bit more. Let, let it be. It's such a small place. We got to be able to hear each other. Come on. Thank you. Unless I keep you, I be keeping you here to about ten o'clock. You know, you be walking around like this right here. All right. Amen. Come on. She's praying for her family. Oh, I need you to point your attention up there. She's all right. Let her, let her, let her, let her soak in the spirit. In the name of Jesus. Will y'all pray with me for it? Yes. Absolutely. Amen. Come on now. The spirit is setting on you even as uh, the spirit is settling on. Oh, my. The Holy Spirit is settling on you now. All right. Now I see some former. Open your eyes. Pick your head up. I see some former situations that happen in the life of your daughter okay yeah and uh uh it's not just the news of of of, of the world and their philosophies it's the actual incidents that praise god uh, 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 uh that help to form her opinions and, and whatnot but god uh is able to to, to even reach into the deep situations of our lives okay. and whatnot. And we're believing God right now Amen. that he's going to do Amen. just that in terms of the healing of her heart, Amen. healing of her mind, yes. in Amen. Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. I receive Amen. So that. we stand in the gap. We bind the spirits. Ah, in the name of Jesus, by the Holy Ghost, we bind the yes. Thank you, God. We bind those spirits that would try to bind 
uh, 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 work over her house and over her life. And in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. In the name of Glory. Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. We just became continue to declare that you receive in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I receive it. I receive it. In the name of Jesus. Praise God. Thank you. So is this is this Jilly? Oh, you got your thing on your face. Stand up, Jilly. Amen. Amen. Glory to God. Thank you, Lord. Just raise your hands up before the Lord. Hallelujah. Come on, just raise your hands up before the Lord. Raise your hands before the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name. Have you got the Holy Ghost? Yes. You have got the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Are you saved? Absolutely saved. Working out my salvation with joy. Jesus' help. Hallelujah. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Praise Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Father God. Now God gives you the desire of your heart, which is uh, some, which is which is something that uh, takes a lot of your not energy, but your focus and your emotion and desire. And God can give you the desire of your heart. Now, in Jesus' name, we believe with you that God will cause you to enter fully into uh, 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 the things that you, that thing that you desire Thank so you greatly. Lord. In Jesus' name. Jesus. Now, in, 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 in your stomach, Amen. praise God, yes. and in your stomach, uh -huh. God is doing Jesus. a work. Yes. Uh -huh. Thank you. Thank you. Not, Thank you. not just spiritual, Jesus. but a physical. Yes. 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 A physical yes. work in Jesus' Glory name. God. Thank God you. bring to you, God brings to you uh, 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 the remedy that you've yes. been, you've yes. been seeking Lord in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. You'll not suffer. Come on. Glory to God. I receive it. That you'll operate in, Thank praise you, God. Thank you, Lord. A, a, a blessing. Now, even now, Thank praise you, God, as I, as I speak, Thank the fire you, of the Lord be upon your belly. Hallelujah. Put your hands on your belly. Yes. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, Glory hallelujah. to God. Fire. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Glory. Glory. Hallelujah. Come on, the fire of the Lord is on your belly. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. I receive it. Yes. I receive it. Glory. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord God. Thank you, Father God. Jesus. Come on, you're the blessing, not the curse. Yes. Come on, I'm blessed and not cursed. I am blessed, not cursed. I'm, and not tail. I'm the head and not the tail. Above and not the knee. I'm above. Woo! 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 In Jesus' name. Come on. In Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory. Glory be to God. Thank you, Jesus. Stand up, Bishop. Thank you, Jesus. Yeah. Out of all the enemy has yes. stolen in your path and tried to do, praise God, you're still here. Well, somebody praise God with me that he's still here. Think not, it's a small thing that the Lord delivers you out of them all. Don't think it's a small thing that God delivers you out of them all. Don't think it's a small thing that God delivers you out of them all. God, uh, God has a heart for you and for your purpose, and God is God is the one who's fashioned and molded and 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 and, and 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 brought you to the place that you are. But He's also the one who has delivered you. The God of deliverance is in your life. Good night, and for all in Jesus' name. The God of deliverance is in your life. I, I want a genuine thank you from you because once you, when you give God a genuine thank you, something's about to take place in your life. Thank you. Thank you, 
God who bought him, thank God, God. Spirit of God, you who bought him over every other yeah. Thank you, Lord. You who bought him over every yeah. thank, thank you, Lord. 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 Thank